We, Dane and Alette from Hikeaholics are embarking on another journey. This time we are in Italy, on the beautiful island of Sardinia. We are hiking the Camino Minerario di Santa Barbara in the southwest of Sardinia. The CMSB is a 500 km long Camino, which is divided into 30 stages. We are hiking stage 11 till 18 from Montimanu to Nuji, 100 km along this beautiful trail. We are walking on the most ancient land in Italy, along mountains, mines, characterized by the millennial mining epic of Sardinia. Welcome to the CMSB. Buongiorno, buongiorno. It's the second day on the Camino and uh, this morning we woke up at Pubushinu. Pubushinu, <laughs> yeah. And the host there, his dinner was incredible. We ate so much. Really, really, really recommend this place. Yeah, he had lots of starters and we thought that was like the whole dish, but they were only the starters. And then we had like a first course and a second course. And he wanted to give us fruits and dessert, dessert and dessert and coffee and it was it was a lot. <laughs> yeah, but we felt very very welcome, and that way we are very energized for today because it's quite a big stage today. It's 21 kilometers to the end place San Benedicto. Uh, San Benedetto. San it Benedetto. are actually two stages combined: stage 12 and stage 13. Yeah. And today we're also gonna visit one of the caves here. There are lots of caves in Sardinia, and the one we are gonna visit is called Sumanau. And we're also going to a temple, and that's the temple the Antas. And yeah, I'm pretty curious how everything looks. Really curious, yeah. yeah. And it's 700 meters of elevation gain today, and 600 meters of descent. But the beginning is quite flat. Enjoying the ice cream. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's really hot outside. And like I'm sweating like crazy. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to eating this ice cream and then going into a really cool cave. <laughs> We're at the entrance of the Sumanau cave um, and they will provide us with an English audio tour. Um, yeah, and I'm really looking forward to the cave. I don't know what to expect to be honest, but let's see.
pretty long day to be honest but the views were incredible and now we're in the posada of San Benedicto if I pronounce it correctly San Benedetto I'm San not Benedetto. sure <laughs> uh, when we arrived here we couldn't find the posada to be honest but the people from this town were very friendly and very helpful we went to a little market where we bought some fresh fruits which we are craving yeah and in every posada that by the way, a posada is a house that's um, organized by the oh. yeah by the organization of the of the of the of the camino, and posada means place of rest. So yeah. this is a place of rest, um, and so it's specially made for the pilgrims who hike the camino. And at every posada, you can give like a gift for the use of their food because in every posada there's like wise and pasta and sauces and um, stuff like that yeah. uh, that like pilgrims can use to cook for themselves and then yeah have a nice evening here yeah, yeah. so uh, let us say it have a nice evening that's what we're going to do now we're going to cook some dinner i think some famous uh, lettuce pasta <laughs> which i'm really looking forward to it and we'll see you The railway track is supposed to be on the right and it's on the left. So that's how we found out that we took the wrong turn accidentally. <laughs> that's crazy! What is it? Yeah, it's like a never ending tunnel. Enjoying the food every single day. <laughs> met some amazing people along the way like Paolo is supposed to be a famous guy here and we just met a couple of people and we gave them beer and it just really makes this day really special I absolutely love it this is my dream place <laughs> <laughs> 